Yeah, Which no. one of these artists that are urban? And None. If not, why not? These two, I can fuck with. That was amazing. And I think vocally, there's a lot of soul influence in her voice. But again, as much as the music she makes is good, I don't think it's necessarily urban. Yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, no. You can't do it with Ed Sheeran. Ed Sheeran, again, very talented artist. Evidently has a lot of influence in within reggae and soul music. But again, I don't think the music he makes is urban music. I don't understand this shit. No offense to Ed Sheeran. Ed Sheeran's a tricky one. I don't know because when I first saw Ed Sheeran, he was singing songs that had a reggae influence in them. When I look at him today, I wouldn't say that he's urban. That's soul, innit? I can see why that's urban, and I can see why that's classified as urban. Like, oh, they fuck with soul. Not so much Jessie J. Her no. album is a bit poppy, but it's as far as what she comes from, yeah. and what she's about, and her so, earlier stuff, she comes from a soul. I'm background. looking like, I don't know nothing about Jessie J, and I check out her material. I don't ever class that as urban. I think Jessie J is an amazing artist, like a proper rich Jessie J. But you see the night in the Momos, when Rich didn't win an award, practically everyone was saying Jessie J is not an urban act. Then when we're in here, and them sticky tabs are on, there we're looking at Jesse J and saying that and I just feel that everyone at Jump Off is very intelligent and they put names up there and they didn't include certain names so there wasn't a distinct urban act and because of that you were forced to say they're kind of an urban act I guess and Adele is the only one because Adele touches me like man them listen to Adele you know you see a few black dudes in a group and they put that as urban you know what I'm saying them dudes ain't urban JLS make pop music to me they make music for 12 year old girls from the counties but wait to you might I'm just saying they got that song, you might look at it. Can I tell you the difference between yeah. the two? Boys to men can harmonise. They're not they just singing the same song. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna say something. Tight yeah, and that's it. I'm sorry, I, I can't even Before this debate, I said I'm not gonna row with poet. Yeah. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not after last one. But if you ever put JLS and Boys to Men in the same <laughs> sentence, <system, laughs> that's disgusting. Yeah. JLS they use dark and lovely hair relaxer. Boys to men, they're amazing. Like, how can you do that? That's like, I, I don't know what that is. What is that? I think, you know, he had a bit of a brain fart and it just came out of his mouth. Poet is a sensible guy and I feel like he's probably downstairs now thinking about it. That's crazy. That's like comparing them to um, Dodacy. Oh my God. Oh no, sorry. <laughs> I mean, I'm saying this, yeah. Adele is the only one out of here I could slap in the in the urban you think Adele's urban. Yeah. She's got soul. But what's Adele? Adele. Adele because of the soul element that she brings to her music. Jesse J's got a little something something going on in it, yeah, but I don't know, man. Jesse like, J's not urban, though. We're talking urban. music of yeah. black origin. Is that's that that's as far as I'm concerned. Yeah, no, what music urban means. Com comes from yeah. uh, black music or comes yeah. from inner city music. I yeah. don't yeah. know what it means. You'd have to ask black? one of the writers for the Guardian. Soul. So do you think Jesse J is urban? She sits on the fence. I think she's got urban record. She dabs in the urban record. That can never be an urban record. Are you crazy? Jesse J, I feel like she is urban. I feel like the music that she's releasing now now isn't however she comes from you know that whole genre of music if you know anything about jesse prior to her releasing her first album then you will know especially if you've seen her performing live the girl she's the truth i can't knock her hustle i understand that the pop market is a lot more lucrative i don't know why she's going down there i'm assuming that's why but i rate her i'm not going to take that from her no do it like a, like, no see, uh, if you're going to say if you're going to say reggae you know reggae derives from love yeah, i'm not having no girl walk around talking about do it like a brother do like it like only, a yeah, that, that record sounds just like any Kerry Hilson, any but I don't even think Kerry Hilson's on urban records. anymore. We're saying that there, because even though Do It Like A Dude has got an urban vibe to it, the rest of the stuff that I have heard yeah. doesn't. Personally, that's why I can't so much put her in the urban cat. It's kind of like what Pink did. Remember back in the day, Pink had her R&B yeah, track. Yeah, yeah. Then all of a sudden, she went heart heart real rock heart. with it. Then you can't put her in the, the urban cat. <laughs> Jessie J, there's a few things that go on that she does, you know, with the riffs and whatever. Like She's got a little urban in there, but the rest of them, nah. Pink came from a rock background, mm. popped with a urban record and then went back to rock. Yeah, yeah, Jesse yeah, yeah. J comes from a genuinely mm. soulful background. Yeah, I agree, man. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Definitely. Did you hear what Lily Allen said about Jesse J when she put him in the moment? Yeah, yeah. Lily Allen should never even speak up. Yeah, Fuck yeah, Lily Allen. Do that tune with um, T Pain. It doesn't matter. Yeah, Jesse J said man them and now she's urban. No, I'm sorry. No, 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 it's not about Jesse J. Like, what is urban? I don't even. I don't know. Then if someone asked me, is Jesse J urban? I think I'd say. To an extent. If you follow Jesse J from the beginning of the career, man. that's cool. So I'll give her that. Yeah. You see her album as a complete album. One track doesn't make you. Uh, like, that's, 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 sorry, album. that's my whole thing. That's a pop album. album. Without a doubt, yeah. I can do it like a dude. It, it's not even really to me urban. In that case, ninety percent of today's R and B is dead. made by black artists. It's dead. Urban either. It's dead. That's music no way more or less pop than what Kerry's doing. What Beyonce's doing. Kerry's pop is rubbish now. They're all rubbish. This is the problem, though, right? Because how do we define it? Because you have to bear this in mind, yeah. Jesse J made one song that we could all. Agree is urban, yeah, but the rest of the stuff isn't. Are we agreeing on that? Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. Right. Some of it can we? Hold on, one second. No, 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 no
Then that's borderline. Can we no, then? Can we then? Oh, no, that's urban. soulful though. It's borderline. That's peak, saying, you know. Do you know what soul is? No, I'm saying it's I'm too, borderline. I don't think it's borderline because I know what soul is, bro. No, that's not no way near soul. I feel down to the artists that are there. That's the reason why we're saying it. Had there ever been other artists there, you wouldn't even say that soul. I'm saying it specifically. No, wait. I'm saying it. Wait. I'm saying it specifically because I know her background, like Snip says. In regards to the rest of the stuff that she's actually released, I think her background and where she's come. From is irrelevant to where she is now. Right. They're talking about Jesse J's past. And Snips and even Teeth, they were both like, she's come from this and she's come from that. Lala said it as well. Yeah, she's come from that. She could have been singing flipping Marvin Gaye songs for 15, 20 years. But at the moment, is she making urban music today? I don't think so. It's just Adele. 21, baby. So we want to share like Share like a fuck no, no. Share like a fuck She's not urban. Wait, wait, wait. In terms of a mainstream artist, she put a more urban artist than anyone else in the mainstream right yeah, now. Yeah. Putting on so fucking what she did, what she did, recognise that she's so not wait, urban. Wait, so wait, wait, so wait, can I ask a question? Though, because she had Gets and, um... Gets, Mike Righteous, Mike Righteous. Okay, because she had them on a track, does that all of a sudden make... But the other one, she got Chef Buster Rhymes, though. Chef Buster Rhymes. Chef Buster Rhymes, yeah, Chef Buster Rhymes. But wait, I'm saying, does that make... That means her money's wrong. Because from other people, does that then make her urban? Do you know what, I'm not necessarily saying she's wholeheartedly urban, but by her intention... Fuck off, Cher Lloyd's not urban. I was quite disgusted at the fact that out of all those artists on the wall, Cher Lloyd was the one that people were giving the most credit to as being urban. Her and JLS are the least urban of anyone on that wall. She disgusts me, I'm sorry. Jesse J, Jesse J say man there makes her no, urban no, no, because no, no, that's her no, 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 I'm not saying that. I'm, I'm, not saying no, that. I'm, I'm saying that. Right. I get the vibe about there. her that she wants to fuck with something that's more yeah, urban. She wants she, to. That's Justin Bieber wants to be urban. Justin Bieber is our bad boy. She is a little 16, 17 year old girl who has watched MTV Bass far too much seen a bit of Kerry Hilson, seen a bit of Janet Jackson, Beyonce and went on X Factor, mimicked them like 17 year olds do and people were blown away by that. This little girl who likes to mimic people who fall within the urban, here we go again, genre. I don't feel like there's anything original coming from her even though they kept saying, oh you're so different, you're so new. What was new and what was different about it? Nothing really. If Cher Lloyd was brown or mixed race or black, would she be easier to define as urban? No. no. Cher Lloyd, is she urban? Uh, I don't know. She ain't urban. We're saying that Jesse J had to do it like a dude, whatever, that had the urban vibe, right? We can't take away from the fact that Cher Lloyd did have a track with Buster Rhymes, which wasn't really poppy. It was slightly urban. And she's got Dot Rotten. And she's oh, got French Rebecca and Hopper. I can see why somebody has she not done a track with Devlin? Is he not Evan? Yeah, very good point. Very good point. Association with other artists does that suddenly make that kind of thing? Is Lloyd Urban? Hmm. I don't know. That's a tricky one. So Lloyd is a fucking tricky one. I'm talking about the beat though. Like, the song that she did with so Devlin was one aspect though. Uh, Robbie Williams did a record mm. over that Barry White break and he mm. rapped on it. Does that make Robbie Williams? No, you can't. No. You can't make it hard because you do one sort of exactly. track and that means you. So that's because Cher Lloyd's management that. said, "Listen, yeah. you're as pop as they come, and I want some it's co-signing real. from the urban world. Right, Let me go and get the hardest artist right. and put it on but your she's record." She's been rapping since X Factor. Yeah, you call that rapping? But you know what it is for me is like I just can't hate on Cher Lloyd. She's a young girl singing. Seeming to be living the dream that she wants to live and people hate on her. I don't get that shit And it's not as if she's trying to champion urban herself I don't know. It doesn't seem like it anyway. It doesn't seem like she's coming across and say look I'm urban accept me as urban and you're not the vibe I get from her is that she wants to do music from this area and I'm not answering that question because I don't really know what it means and <laughs> I'm not sure if I'll put her in that category. That I don't know what it means. What? Well, uh, ah, I don't even want to fucking talk. But yeah, hope you got what I fucking wanted to say <laughs> Yeah you know what I'm saying like though, she's rapping. Like 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 Misha be urban. Yes. 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 Why? Why? Why is Misha urban? Oh, 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 Let Jay finish. Jay, go on, say what you was going to say. I was just simply saying that Cher Lloyd probably rapped 
more or the same amount as Misha B exactly. on X Factor the right. year after Cher Lloyd. Here I'm saying is Cher Lloyd urban? Like, is Misha B urban? I think you can't say one person is not and then say the other person is. I think the question you have to ask to clarify whether or not that person is urban is if that person was black, would you say that they were urban? But well, Robbie please, Williams raps please. as well. But you see Cher Lloyd when she raps and she sings. I don't feel well, nothing. Is, you see this, yeah? See when I did that? Does that make me Steven Gerrard? Well, wow. Exactly. <laughs> You see music here, yeah? like I said, I was saying to Snips the other day, it's all about a message, innit? And I need to believe these artists when they sing, I need to feel something. That's not what they just take, no, 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 that's classified as music. So yeah. they're not even making any genre of music to me, fam. Cher <laughs> Lloyd is not making anything that I think yeah, anyone should listen that's, to. That's Adele, when she makes music, yeah, like, you feel it though, fam. So I can classify it as something. Well, you see Cher Lloyd, she's making disposable Where crap. You like There's some artists I don't believe, I don't want to say any names, I don't want to upset anyone, man. Like, I just don't believe you. I just feel like you're just doing what's required in order to sell, and potentially, you're potentially selling, that's good, you know? You found your market and you're running with it but i just don't think when it comes to music it's worth anything i don't know about you if you're from the urban scene fam you will know that the urban scene is very very real i, don't, I haven't bought her album i know you wouldn't i know you wouldn't listen <laughs> them taps on your arm if you're buying that i'm disappointed you know what i'm saying <laughs> I'm gonna tell you straight away, cuz the urban scene, what everyone loves about it is the realness about it. Certain artists, they're so real, yeah, nah, they tell still, you their story, no, 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 their struggle. If urban is what I like, which I feel is urban, then it has to be something real. It has to be something that's genuine. When the person says what they say, someone has to relate to it. Like, wow, I remember when that happened to me, or it makes me feel a certain way. Like, there's certain music you hear, and I'm sure Jade hears as well, and it's like, it just takes you back, like, right, it reminds me of something. And if you're not doing that, because it's all soulful, it all comes under the category of soul, and soul's from in here, you know? So that's all real. That's all subconscious. So subconsciously, you will connect with me if it's having to be an effort and i just don't rate it i'm sorry if someone has to shape your sound i just don't understand all of that i don't know what the hell shayla is talking about jls or four wankers i grew up on mob deep nas mary j john you're talking about singers there man d'angelo you can't talk about shayla maybe adele in the same sentence as any of those artists man's talking about brown sugar and you want to talk about this yeah to me none of them are urban acts at all normal we get yeah plural in a yard, in yeah. a road, in a kebab shop, anywhere yeah. fam. Yeah. When you're just listening to music, anyhow you become okay. American. But you said it was all right for gentlemen. You said it was all right for gentlemen. If you come in here, hold on, hold on. If, you're, if you come in here and say, saying about black artists is why is it just pro green who gets that one hip-hop slot what, what, what judge it? made judge them, it over the course of a year but this is what i'm saying what made them go with pro green over time urban music makes up more than 50 percent of the chart i don't really know too much about fucking what, what music i don't know i don't know about garage i don't fucking listen to garage